This could be the first generation of children in the United States that lives less than its parents. I got two pills I take for my diabetes, then I got one for cholesterol, high blood pressure, and then I take Bieta, which is an injectable. I'm getting really shaky, and I'm sick, and I'm fatigued, and that's when they diagnose me with hypertension and diabetes. Obesity, diabetes, heart disease, high blood pressure cost this country more than $120 billion each year. People are saying, you're crazy. You're a cancer patient. You should be resting. Doctors told me this. When I had the second heart attack, the doctor said, I should prepare for death. Heart disease is an absolutely toothless paper tiger that need never, ever exist. People who were raised in Japan, the Philippines, Korea, China, never had heart disease, prostate cancer, colon cancer, breast cancer, rheumatoid arthritis, multiple sclerosis. This is the atlas of cancer mortality in China. Virtually the Western diet was non-existent. They had no animal products, they had no dairy, no meat. We learned that we could turn on and turn off cancer growth just by adjusting the level of intake of that protein. I knew at that point what caused most diseases. Our national authorities are simply excluding this concept in order to protect the status quo. With the Western diet, there are going to be half a million people in this country this year who will have to have the front half of their body divided, their heart exposed. Some people would call that extreme. I know of nothing else in medicine that can come close to what a plant-based diet can do. If you go through life thinking that what happens to you from a health perspective is based on your genes, you're a helpless victim. I reversed the diabetes. The diabetes is not coming back. I just can't understand what it's done to change my life. Diet is so much more important than anybody ever thought. To me, the answer is so simple, it's criminal. And it's just people starting to take responsibility for their health and starting to eat more plant-based foods. It's that simple.